right, Guitar Strap. Guitar Straps fundamentally play this role. They are your first line of defense to help you play more, play better, and to express yourself. Now, this video is sponsored by Sweetwater because they are an amazing resource for you and me to find cool guitar straps, find more accessories that help you play more guitar in your life. Thanks, Sweetwater, for sponsoring this. And this video is all uh, featuring Levy guitar straps. Levy, if you've been around guitar playing long enough, you have seen them, you've heard them, you've played them, you've felt them, you've been envious of other players that have them. Now, these guitar straps are so cool. There are some pivotal questions to ask yourself when you're trying to figure out what is right for you. Number one, is your guitar light or heavy? Because that's probably the biggest thing that will help you uh, get the most out of your guitar playing. If you have a guitar that is very heavy, like for example, this is my PV Falcon, which is, it hurt my shoulder just pulling up. This guitar is probably 11 pounds. So the trick with really heavy guitars is to pair them with a really squashy, really comfortable guitar strap, like this white Levy here. And what I love about this is that it carries that weight. It's all about surface area. Think about Ellen's elephant's feet. I don't know why that's my example, but think about like you're spreading out weight. You want something squishy. You want something soft. You want something wide. And so that it makes it to where the guitar is really comfortable. And so for me, I'm carrying a heavy guitar, but it's not crazy. So white, squishy leather strap. Awesome. Also, by the way, hang around to the end. I'm going to give away a bunch of these straps and I'll give you details at the end. So the next question to ask yourself is if you have a guitar that is heavy, in a particular place. If your guitar is neck heavy, like my Fender Acoustasonic, this guitar is incredibly light. It's only 4.6 pounds, I think. We just put a video, I'll put a video card up here for this one. But this guitar, if it does have a way that it wants to hang, there's some weight to the neck here. And so one of the things is certain straps wouldn't work as well for you in that situation. For example, if you would get, and this, how cool is this strap? Uh, this is like the 90s soda can. Um, but if you would put a strap like this, a really slick strap on a neck heavy guitar, so think an SG as well, would not do you justice or your guitar playing. So as soon as I let go, you feel it because this is so slippery on a t-shirt. So the flip for this is that you would either need to wear like a flannel shirt or a shirt with some kind of texture to it. Or the other way is to get a strap that has raw hide on the back and it would grab on your shirt a little bit more and it wouldn't leave you to a place where I see it's just doing it. It's just dropping down on its own. But this guitar strap is super cool. So pay attention, where is your guitar heavy? Front, back. Another question to consider is if you use guitar strap locks. So for me, I love the Duncan or the Dunlop uh, strap locks on most of my guitars, I use those. But there are straps that the ends of the straps are just simply too thick for that style and it also really commits you to that strap can only work on either that guitar or the guitars that you put strap buttons on. So just keep that in mind. Do you use strap locks? There's two strategies for this. Two strategies? Oh, goodness. Okay, there's two strategies. One, you get all of your money into one really good strap, and you should definitely do that. A really great leather strap. You know, those ones that are 100 bucks, 120 bucks, they're awesome. The quality is amazing. Levy's offers a ton of those. There will be some of the options and preferences that I have in the description down below. Now, the, the thing with that is if you have one strap, that means that strap has to be able to go up and down pretty easily because not all guitars and instruments get played at the same height. So if you have a strap that works out really well, that can extend, that can allow you to play down low, then when you play your mandolin or whatever, you pull it up higher. The other way is you could just have multiple straps and that's the place that I've done because all of this ties together. So remember at the beginning of this video, I said that guitar straps help you play more, play better and express yourself. So for me, having multiple straps that cover, like sometimes I'm in funny moods and sometimes I want something goofy and silly, and sometimes I want things even more ridiculous and over the top, and then there are other times that I just want something that complements the guitar really well. The other thing I found is as someone that plays a pink paisley telly and also loves absurdity, that's why I love the paisley, but what I found is with that guitar, I need something a little more calm, a little more subdued, to let the vibrancy and the absurdity of that guitar shine. So if you have a plain guitar, you can get a really crazy strap. If you have a crazy guitar, you should get a really plain and kind of subdued strap that, strap that doesn't take too much attention away. So when it comes to guitar straps, this is one of the coolest ways that you get to express yourself. Bright colors, subdued, comfortable, really thin, really eccentric. Wherever you are in the guitar playing world, wherever, whoever you are in the guitar playing world, you get to show it off. Thank you so much to Levy's for making these amazing guitar straps, for making the guitar playing experience so much cooler with these great leather straps. 
Also, thanks to Sweetwater for sponsoring this video. If you have any questions, comments, slanderous remarks, let me know in the comments down below. There will be links for each of these straps. Levy's has a thousand choices. There were pages and pages and pages of choices uh, to make this video, and these are the ones that I picked, so you'll get to know me a little bit just by the absurdity that this is what I would just pick on a Tuesday afternoon, uh, picking out straps to make a guitar video about. So, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Okay, here's how you win the guitar straps. I want you to donate 10 dollars to an organization to a nonprofit that makes the world a better or and more musical place so the first five people that do that i will send you these straps for free i think the most affordable of these straps was like 30 or 40 bucks everything else is either 50 60 80 100 bucks do that first five people fill the world with music and friendship make the world a better place donate money to a nonprofit. So all you have to do is send that invoice to me, send a copy of your receipt to info at jeremyshepherd.com. We'll put all the link and the details down below. This is how we will make the world a better and more friendly place and more musical place is by offering opportunities to be wildly generous and also spread good in the world. Thanks for watching. See you guys later.